a five inch floppy. Porn. Hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. <laughs> What's up, rascals? Welcome back to Paul Americum. We have just entered Delta Complex and are about to explore more. And apparently there are more evil plasticky creatures. And ooh, this is an interesting intercom. Future tech! Like, video phone ahead of its time. Like what's... Like, like the phone companies were advertising in the 80s. Oh yeah, this was supposed to be this facility was supposed to be running in the 80s. So, yeah. <laughs> Interesting. That was a truck. Why is there an X there? I don't want to stand there. There's... Hello? Ugh. Going towards the fire, like, that's a smart thing to do. Oh, God. Toxic fumes. Oh, gotta get away from that. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I... Alright. Get me out of that. Oh. I need a breather. Oh, boy. Oh. <laughs> Are we good? No. Okay. Alright. Gotta... 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 Oh, this, that was making me super dizzy. I'm assuming that's where the little hell spawn truck came from. What the? Why? Straight up, why? I don't... I didn't... I didn't... What? I am getting so confused here. There was no reason for shattered glass there. I, what, did I walk into shattered glass? P apparently, but it didn't look like there was glass there to be walked into or shattered. Now I'm a little bit apprehensive about going down a frickin' corridor in case there's another, maybe, maybe a frickin' motorcycle will come down and wreck my shit. I don't know. Another week and I can close this office forever. Monica already went to the vault last week and didn't come back. I don't see why I have to keep up the EDP here on my own. We don't need that anymore. I haven't received any news from Alpha headquarters in three days. It seems as if we have been completely separated from the other areas, along with the M1 station. Thanks, Connie. Um, oh, nice pixel art. I like it. Uh, anything else in here? Maybe, uh... Hmm. Um, checking drawers. Nope. Alright. Is there another reason to... Should I check this room, too, real quick? I can't. Okay. So, I'll just go the way I can. Which I hope is this way. Hello? Oh. Oh, hello. Right now... Oh, look! The manual for the computers. The day has come. I have to leave Connie alone here, but I'm sure that he will be able to keep the EDP in good shape without any problems. It won't be long before he is also called to come. The pain of never seeing our beloved families again hit him and hit me hard. After all, it will be a consolation for me to go to the eternal hunting grounds with my best colleague. The eternal hunting group. You Native American? I thought this was from Germany. Well, she might have immigrated. I don't know. <laughs> They're all calling out from the grave. Bitch, you don't know my life! <laughs> or in this case, afterlife. Oh, keys. I got a key. The general key. I didn't know they had rank. I think I'm getting forgetful. I constantly leave the general key somewhere where where no one will find it again. Conveniently, I've left this note right where the key is, so whatever. 
This whole situation down here is driving me crazy. Yesterday, there was a violent argument with the conference in the conference room. Heidi approached me crying. Since then, she has locked herself in her apartment and does not answer. Bernd has always... I think there was an A missing there. Bernard has always thought about breaking the door. He's worried that she has done something to herself. If so, I can understand it. Similar thoughts are already coming to me. Oh, Benny boy. I... Did we... We just went in a biggie circle? Hey. I hear that. Don't... Don't... Don't make weird noises. Don't go kaboomy explodey, please. Oh. Okay, this... This doesn't look good at all. Um... Frickin' culty-like, in fact. Where did this thing come from? Not cool. Oh, dear. The fact that I can interact with that concerns me just slightly. Um... Screw it. Let's, let's tr see what happens. Excuse you? I need an audio tape for this. Okay. So I guess I'm finding an audio tape. Uh, maybe not go that way. Since there's toxic fumes that... that hurt my face. And other things. Hello? Does anyone here have an audio tape? Okie dokie. Maybe... Maybe in here? Some milk and creamer for the coffee. Delicious. A five-inch floppy. Porn. It's actual porn. Oh my god. Um, thank god it's blurred for me, so I don't... <laughs> uh, in the current state, the cages are unusable. The last attempt to keep dark guard trapped in... What do you mean, dark guard? Unfortunately, the magnetic field in the cage was much too weak. Our technician, Daniel Ziller, suffered severe injuries when he tried to activate the emergency shutdown of the hypersonic generator. He was immediately taken to the medical research station. I haven't heard from him since. The doctors there didn't want to give me any information. Well, that's kind of a dick move. It is all my fault. I made a big mistake with the magnetic field calculation. The whole night I did new calculations with Stefan's help. I'm sure I've found a solution now. The next cage will fulfill its function. Tonight I have to take care of Akira. I left her alone the whole day. I'm such a bad father. Luckily, she understands that we're in a dangerous situation right now. Dr. T. Yokohama. Okay. Um... Carrying on, looking for an audio tape. Hopefully, in one of these files... Quiet, you! The drippy, splishy guy is back again. All folders sorted in the room tidied up. A pointless achieve... A pointless achievement, I think. Which will probably never be seen by anyone again. But at least it kept your mind off of other things, and, and in its own way, that helps too. So, yippee skippy. Okay, what about in here? Hello? Okay. I don't know if I should tell the others or not. Today I had a strange vision during the substance conjuring. There is a cult going on here. For a short time, it looked as if there was a fourth person in the room. Somehow this man looked familiar to me, but I don't trust my mind anymore anyway. Yeah, well, you shouldn't be messing with... evil stuff. Claiming it's science. When you mix science with pure evil, you get... very naughty results. Ugh blood and sacrifices. A huge discussion about pointless stuff. 
And all because yesterday a strange old guy came here in the Delta Complex. He claimed to be the gardener from the Alpha Building. He was totally confused, talking about a trainee who is now being held in the medical research station. If it were up to me, we should just let the gardener disappear unnoticed. He has no business here. I think he already knows too much. So Delta Complex is all the people doing the real stuff and the Alpha group were like all their guinea pigs? Does that mean that the place mysteriously sank on purpose? Who knows? Well, who alive knows? Somebody down here knew. But, uh, can't really talk to them now. Can only read their notes. What's this one say? They're insane! Now they think they can fight the material anomaly with a ritual. Last time Volker grew bigger and bigger and almost destroyed the whole facility. I'm so happy when I get out of here. Um. Oh, great. So, so... Okay, so the cult was started after the fact. Still unsettling. But, um... Hey, is this where we started? It is! I still need to find an audio tape, though. <laughs>